As a senior who's graduating in a little bit over a semester, I just want to talk about why I chose my major, which is business administration at UC Berkeley, and sort of my story and how that came along. But before we start the video, be sure to click the subscribe button because I checked my 30-day analytics and only 11% of people who watch my videos are subscribed. So please subscribe, it would help a lot. I made a lot of videos on my channel about the business major at Berkeley, my experiences and stuff related to recruiting and careers and stuff like that. So I just want to go back to how I chose my major actually and the events that led me to this decision in college. Basically, ever since I was young, I've always been pretty entrepreneurial. By the way, sorry if there's background noise, I kind of live on a busy street with a lot of cars. So when I was young, I've always been the more artsy slash crafty type of person. So I've been to a lot of like drawing classes since I was little. I got into sewing actually when I was in like middle school. I began making these plush toys and realized that there was a need amongst the teenage market for cute plush toys and I sold them at my school's holiday fairs and I eventually started selling them on YouTube and Etsy. I actually used to make YouTube videos on this like way way back but I actually sold a lot of stuff on Etsy growing up. Along with that I also flipped a lot of items so I would like find stuff to resell and sell them at a higher price to other customers who were willing to buy these products. Capitalism. And also throughout high school, I've done a lot of activities relating to marketing and PR in various clubs and stuff. So I've always sort of gravitated towards that space ever since I was growing up. And I feel like throughout my education, I feel like I wasn't really strong in a specific area of study. Personally, I did lean more towards the math and science side if I had to choose something else other than business. This kind of led me to the conclusion to study business in college. So ever since I was applying to colleges in high school, I've already knew in the back of my mind that I wanted to major in either econ or business coming into college. And luckily I was able to get into UC Berkeley, which has one of the best business programs in the country. So I feel really grateful to people study what I want to at this school. When I first applied to Berkeley, you can only apply as undeclared. In order to get into the business major here, you actually have to apply as a sophomore at Berkeley. I applied to Haas in my sophomore year. The acceptance rate to the business major at my school was around 33%. So it was actually pretty difficult to major in business at some schools, especially like Berkeley, where there's an admissions process to get in. For me, it was either business or econ. And I feel like econ is a lot more theoretical. You learn more about the macro trends of the economy and specific parts of theory that isn't exactly as applicable to the real world as business and i feel like you learn more skills that you can see yourself using in the real world so that's mostly what drew me to the business major versus the econ major and also with berkeley's business major you can't really choose a specific like concentration major because i know other schools they have like marketing majors finance majors but at Berkeley, everyone receives a Bachelor's of Science in Business Administration. So it's a very broad major, but you can choose the specific classes you want to take. And so you have the freedom to basically take any elective classes as long as you do the core curriculum. Actually, for the core curriculum, there's like a really broad list of classes that I've taken. Business communications, accounting, marketing, um, business analytics, leading people, and uh, social and ethics of business. Those are the main classes and besides that, I've been able to choose other classes to take. This semester, I'm taking a class on investments and next semester, I'm taking some more marketing focused classes such as like consumer behavior, growth marketing, and another people's class. I'm taking more finance and marketing based classes, but if you're interested in a specific field, there are so many classes within like the whole business realm that you can choose from. Not only finance and marketing, there's also accounting, operations, HR, there's even other classes that your school may offer. So I feel like if you're interested in business as a whole, but you're not that sure about which parts of business you want to do, it's basically really easy to try out several different kinds of classes and choose specific fields because there's just so many things that you can choose from. It's not just one specific thing. 
Because if you think about what business majors do, you're basically learning how to administer a business or how a business works. So hopefully that when you graduate college, you can get a job in a specific field. And some people actually end up starting their own businesses in the future and become entrepreneurs. So there's just so many career options when it comes to majoring in a field within business. Also the thing with classes, I really like the upper division classes much more than the lower divs where you have to go through statistics, principles classes, econ. I feel like there's just so many people in those classes Actually, at a public school like Berkeley, there's just so many people in those classes. Especially like the principal's class is not super representative of the major, I'd say. And a lot of people, I think, are turned off by a particular major by taking the intro classes. But once you get to those higher level classes, there's actually so much more in depth about the major that you can't really get from those lower division classes. And before anyone comes at me saying that the business majors have it easy or whatever, all the stereotypes you hear about business, business is definitely hard in its own way. And I feel like for more calculation heavy courses, you're using a different part of your brain. Within business, you're working with a lot of people. There's lots of presentations, speaking, and a lot of like soft skills that that aren't really used in other fields. Classes are important as a business major, but so much of the work also goes on when you're not in class. So this includes a lot of like extracurriculars, networking, getting to know other people. When you're majoring in a business field, classes only get you so far and a lot of the work comes from practicing and doing in real life. So I actually joined several organizations in college kind of related to um, consulting and marketing so i joined my school's newspaper marketing organization i also joined a small business consulting club i definitely honed a lot of my business and marketing skills and interests through the extracurriculars just because there's just so much going on outside of school that you can develop your skills with so that's kind of my opinion on when people say business majors are easy, it's actually a lot more work than you expect. If you're watching this video considering a business degree, I think you should consider your interests and what you're most naturally drawn to and see if you're able to picture yourself taking the classes. There's always a lot of classes that you can take and also extracurriculars that you can try out and see what interests you the most. Business in general is pretty soft skill focused, so I'll think about if you enjoy doing that kind of stuff because it involves a lot of like people skills. For myself, I feel like I am more introverted. I feel like even if the idea of talking to a lot of people and working with people intimidates you, it's always, I feel like, a skill that you can develop and practice. But I think it also depends on your personality. I guess another con to the business major, there might be a sense of competitiveness, especially depending on the program you go to. And I feel like in my experience, there is a lot of like self-pressure at Berkeley. That's definitely something that I've noticed when it comes to the business major. I'm not sure about other schools, but this is how Berkeley kind of operates. The other thing is that it's not just classroom learning. It's not just classroom learning. I feel like a lot of the stuff that you take away from your experience comes from outside the classroom, and this includes networking. I think networking is also important at your school and with your alumni because these alumni are able to help you get to certain parts of your career or help you out in the future. And there's a saying that your network is equal to your net worth. So I think to be frankly honest, if you go to a school that is ranked pretty well, like Berkeley, a lot of the alumni have probably stronger connections to various companies or places that you're interested in. So I feel like if you have a resource, it's really good. Definitely, I feel like it's not something to stress too much about because you can always reach out to alumni of your school to get to know how their career path is like and make those connections from there. when it comes to job hunting and salary. I feel like once again, business is such a broad field and there's just so many jobs that you can do when it comes to business. I think at Berkeley, the most common routes that people tend to go into are banking slash finance, consulting, roles in the tech industry, and accounting. So I feel like those are the most common career paths that people in my school go to. 
and I think those specific industries have the highest salaries so it's not uncommon to hear new grads coming out from the business school making over 100k a year. I think in general like salaries can be between like 60,000 to 120,000 depending on the sector or field you go into. Yeah, personally, I'm going into the tech industry after graduation. I'm doing product marketing. I've actually made a few videos about my experience of getting my internships, recruiting and things like that. So Check out one of the videos linked above in the cards or in the description to see those. I feel like internships are really important in college because the more experience you get as a student while you can, the easier it will be to understand what you want to do in the future and to get the experience to land a job after you graduate. I think by doing a lot of these internships outside of just school and learnings also helped me kind of like figure out what I want to do after graduation and stuff like that. I think there are some students who are also starting their own companies or small businesses. There are a lot of people who go into entrepreneurship as well down the line or maybe even out of college if that's a thing you're interested in too. So that was my story and background why I chose business as my major and what I think about the business major in general and let me know if you are potentially thinking of majoring in business at your college don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel oh my god so loud outside anyways I'll see you in the next video bye